Chapter 4. Git won't fall out of the sky. Knowing the history of Git and its origins as the version control system for the Linux kernel goes a long way to explain one of its more glaring shortcomings. Why does it seem so damn hard to use? The answer is, of course, that Linux kernel developers are rather comfortable with all this complexity. They know exactly what Git does under the hood, and as a result, all its numerous commands make sense to them. People who've mastered Git are like airline pilots. To the layman, all those dials and buttons in the cockpit seem like an impenetrable wall of confusion. Without any insight into how an airplane works and what keeps it in the air, trying to learn all these buttons is going to be frustrating at best. If you'd like to learn how to fly, the smart way to go about it is to first understand what keeps a plane in the air. Likewise, if you want to learn Git, the smart way to do it is to first understand how it keeps track of changes. So let's start there, and keep in mind that unlike airplanes, Git won't fall out of the sky when we make a mistake.